guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Landon and we are here again today for this long hair is a effing mess. No, we are here today to finish up our live reactions for Love Yourself Tear Album Era. We have five videos to go over today and let me explain why that is. Today we are going to be watching live performances of Airplane Part 2, 2 on Pan Mons, So What, and an outro tier performance. So I, like I said in my last video, there was not too much choreo at all. There was none. But I'm thinking this is the video that the choreo is going to come out. And if it doesn't come out, I know the tears will. So either way, something's going to happen. But no, I'm so excited, especially after watching the Airplane Part 2 music video. I'm so excited to see if they could do the choreography because I love that shit. They say, El Mariachi. Oh man, he had, like the suavity, the coolness, the pure swag, pure aura. You know what I'm trying to say. I can't put it into words, but. <laughs> and I was told I need to watch two performances of Von Panman just to get both sides of the story. I don't know what that means, but we're gonna figure it out together. Obviously here right now, okay, are you ready? If you're ready, I'm ready. So without any further ado, let's watch some what? Okay, so the first one we're gonna watch today is Airplane Part 2, a comeback show. So it's a little bit not as Tory, more along the lines of broadcasting. So fingers crossed these angles don't suck. <laughs> I told y'all we either go get smiles or tears. Something's gonna happen. Some emotion will leak. This is different. Oh, 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 oh. You think you're bad. Bad, you bad. You are. What is this? Yeah. Oh. You better snatch it. What are these outfits? Wait, what is this? The outfits, I didn't expect it. Oh, yeah. Wait, 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 go, 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 thank you. Holy, holy. He said, I need two mics. My favorite move. Uh, I'm loving how they just bounce. What's really cool about this one is that they really do a lot of bouncing to groups and to groups and segments as far as the choreography. They'll have the wind consistent that's kind of bouncing around and right now it was Hobie obviously, but it just shows how everybody can just catch on and know their cues, know exactly where they need to be standing. All these things are so hard to do, especially live <laughs> in front of a studio audience. I'm sure at this point they've gotten a little bit more used to it, but I can't even imagine the beginnings, especially with these intricate stages they have now, like so much can go wrong, I'm sure. I don't mean to be that person, but I'm gonna be that person, okay? But because the, they kill it, they do it great every time. Okay, sorry, <laughs> going back. Why have I never seen this? Uh, what? <laughs> See that moment right there? RM, if we, what if you would have dropped it? I'm like in love with Jen's suspender look here. This little ass guy. The look they have in their eyes, they just know. They know. It must be so cool to see these done for the first time ever. You know what I mean? When it's actually the comeback and you're watching it and just seeing the new era that's here. You know what I'm saying? Like that's insane to me. Okay, so I loved it. I'm so glad we got some choreography back in here, but let's talk about those outfits really quickly. They might be my favorite. It's just because they were so different and so unexpected, but for some reason worked out better than I could have ever dreamed. Okay, the next one we'll be watching today is on Panmon. Waiting for on Panmon. Mnet, in case you haven't seen my uh, fake love video, I just wanted to update y'all on that. The video got blocked five times before I could update it again. And it's so crazy to me because there are so many people that uploaded directly the full video. They'll watch the full thing. I will cut it, flip it, block the logos. And like, when I say cut it, I'll cut out like half the performance and I'll still get blocked. Like not even like copyright, Fringe man or whatever, a little strike or nothing. It's just straight up blocked. 
how do some creators do it? How do some reactors do it? I need y'all answer me, because I don't know. It's probably gonna take me 17 hours to figure this out. So with that being said, I'm sure Mnet's gonna get this. All of these can be viewed in full on my Patreon. So without any further ado, we're gonna be watching the comeback show. And these outfits I see again. Waiting for... Am I the only one that just hears that randomly? I can't be. In my head, like I'll just be sleeping and just freshly wake up and all of a sudden you're waiting for <laughs> hey, like, let me wake up first, bitch. Okay, like. <laughs> They'll look to their eyes. Oh. <laughs> Why is it so cool? <laughs> what the f? Who <laughs> over here doing my contemporary jokes? You mean to tell me this is the same comeback shows era that we saw the comeback shows for Fake Love and for <laughs> Airplane Part 2? Like, all of this is the same era? Oh, variety. Oh, variety. Okay, we're gonna go back and watch the jump again because, bitch. <laughs> yeah, yeah, look, straight up. I just, I'm dead. <laughs> Tay, Tay is having too much fun. I think he thinks he's a superhero and I love it. Wait, why does he look like a bro in a frat? He's the frat bro that's gonna walk up to you and was like, what's up, bro? You ever heard of Pod Pod Capo? <laughs> yeah, man, we do some crazy shit around here. Fuck, man, bro. Go wild parties, bro. Got the chicks, bro. <laughs> Can't even do it. And then RM over here looking a little bit more incarcerated, but it's okay, it's okay. We see what we're going for here. Look at Kate's face, I can't. Is this my new Hobie leather overall? Fantasy going on? I hate it, it's so cheesy, I love it. <laughs> they don't. <laughs> Stop. Stop. This is my favorite, y'all. This song is just so fun, and I like love how they took it to space and the outfits and the choreo. Actually insane. Actually insane. I love how they did a lot of superhero references and things like that in there. It's a little cheesy, but that's the song, I think. It's meant to be a little bit more cheesy, but for some reason, they could always take cheesy and make it even more cheesy, but cheese that works. Maybe like, you know how like sometimes people eat moldy cheese? That's not this case. Um, this is aged cheese. But isn't cheese aged just molding? I'm not a culinary artist. I don't know. Let me know how that works. But that was good. That shit was good. <laughs> We're going to watch another one. This is on Ponmon from the tour now. So Emily said I need to watch both to see something. <laughs> I don't know. We're going to find out together. What's up, Brazil? What's up, Brazil? I heard Brazil goes hard. <coughs> I was gonna say, I think she chose this because of sugar with glasses. And I think that I'm okay with this. I'm, I will watch a whole thing just to see intellectual sugar here. But as I pause the video to say that, I see there's a bouncy house. So I'm gonna just stop talking and let this play out itself. Cause I don't know what's about to happen. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yes! How fun is 
that? How fun is that? And how many of you of you are professional K-pop idols right now would have done the same thing? You know, like I didn't think I needed it, but now I will never go into a stage if I ever make it to a stage without a bouncy house. No, that's only for if you make it. <laughs> Look at Jiddy, so happy. He just came down that slide and made me so happy. Okay. <laughs> The pure joy. Keep falling, falling, still back. Who do you know that would do this? And these poses that he has decided to put on himself. I'm just saying, boy. I'm just saying, boy. <laughs> I'm just saying. Who's standing back there? Who's that? Y'all see that? I'm scared. <laughs> That was the best thing I've ever seen in my life. I didn't know how it could get better. I had so much fun and I didn't even do one bounce. And that's how you know shit's real is when you don't even bounce, but you still have fun. Imagine being at a par birthday party, okay? And seeing the kids inside of the bouncy house having so much fun, but knowing you can't get in there, but in your head, you're still having as much fun as the kids. Like that's what's happening here. I don't need to be in there to feel it. Okay. Great call for both, great call for two. All right, so the next one we're gonna watch today is called So What? And like I said in my old video, my album reaction, So What was not a bad song, don't get me wrong. It's just one that was a little bit more generic to me that I just did not click with immediately. I've listened to it a few times and it's gotten better, but they said that honestly it will change with the live. So I'm excited to see that. I love the experimentation of them. So when something has a little bit more of a basic melody and a little bit more of a basic drop type of thing, it doesn't pique my interest, but it still makes me look, you know? But let's see if the choreo or, or the stage presence can um shift it a little bit. Y'all know I'm 100% real with y'all here. We're not over here trying to lie or whatever. Um, so let's do it. So Okay. We're doing a little bit more club. Okay, so yeah, it definitely does help to see their energy in this as well. That brings these beats and words to life, is what you could say. I will say, this is just a typical night out in West Hollywood, though. <laughs> this. <laughs> if you were to take it and put it to a large scale and just make it be just miss going in public and like dancing, doing things like that. Okay. How did that get emotional? <laughs> um, <laughs> let's keep going. But I like it. I, I thought there was gonna be more like strict choreography, but them just like running around and jumping up and down and giving life, it suits it. It suits it. <laughs> Look 
he can get away with that. They all technically can, <laughs> honestly. Okay, so that was So What, the performance. Like I said, it was so much fun to see it performed live, the fireworks, the light show, everything about it gave it so much more energy. It would be so much fun to see in concert. I can't even imagine what it was like to really be there and to see that live. Like I said, it did remind me of just a typical Hollywood clubbing night out in a good way because it may be nostalgic for it, but it feels like I can get my fix there. You know what I'm saying? Like I can just watch this four or five times and then never want to go out again for another year ourselves. Like that's all I need is my fix. <laughs> all right. We have one more left today. It is tear. And I guess we're going to end it on a cry note. Like we started on a cry note, ended on a cry note. Uh, it's fine. Luckily, I think this is the um, tour rip. So I don't have to read the lyrics exactly to make me get there in the sadness factor. But we'll feel the emotion, I'm sure, of it. So without any further ado, our last one. Tear. <laughs> Light shows are so amazing. Like quality, budget. <laughs> See that? You see how fast he rapped that shit? My freak. My freak. Uh, not my freak. My freaking goodness is what I was trying to say, but. <laughs> um, I don't know why I paused it. so great that was so energy filled and they hit every single word every single word on that damn stage we witnessed today okay guys <laughs> well i guess that does it for love yourself tear i loved all those performances so much the thing about them is that they were so diverse and unique every single one of them that it's insane to me they were all on the same album once you think about it like it fits on the album they work together but then in real life when you see how they take each individual and deconstruct it it's like how did y'all manage that and I think that's what makes their music so interesting to me. It makes me keep coming back for more. 
And I hope that you guys enjoyed it too. I mean, I guess technically, besides some storyline stuff, we do have, you know, another extended version of Fake Love. We do have some more tier notes. Besides that, I think the tier era is coming to a close. Already, bitch. What the fuck? What the fuck? But I hope that you guys enjoyed it. I can't believe we made it this far already. Like I said, so much more in the future to come. Please feel free to suggest things that you guys want to see on the channel eventually. I, like I said, we'll be doing some more commentary type videos after the roadmap where I'll go through and kind of analyze each one. A little bit less of the quick reaction stuff and more of the in-depth editing and stuff like that. Stuff that I really wanted to start to do. So um, with these reactions and stuff, they're, they're flip them over. You got to get them out, get them out kind of thing. But I do want to spend some time on some like hard-hitting editing videos. I don't know. Anyway, I love you. I can't believe my one-year anniversary, armyversary, is right around the corner. We'll talk about that more later, but make sure you click like, comment, subscribe, and I'll be back soon. I love y'all. Bye. I would love to know them by name. So,